Hi everyone, it's Lori and welcome to my channel. I hope you're all doing well today. So it is time for our um, hashtag Roxy's Journal of Stitchery. And this is for the month of April. So we now have the prompts and they are Old Quilt and Country Cottage. And when I saw the Country Cottage, guys, I was so excited. And I was excited because I remembered I actually had, and it happens to be quilted too, um, but this right here was a, a little house. Look at it. Look at how cute. It was a thank you gift. I'm not sure. I think I want it this way. It was a thank you gift from um, Jody at Jody Loves Vintage. And she's the one I had gotten the butterflies from. Um, yeah, and I also got the rabbit from her as well. However, the rabbit, I did take the batting out, but they're all quilted pieces. Um, so this is the house I'm going to be using. Now I did cut off a little bit here and here to make it shorter and skinnier uh, because it was like protruding off of the, the page on each side. So our little house. I am so excited. Thank you, Jody. And then I found this piece of vintage quilt here. Um, yeah, so we are going to use it. So that's going to go there. And then we are going to put our little house on here. Um, it doesn't leave me a lot of room down here. Um, let me see. I was thinking about maybe if I could find a blue yo-yo to put it up here. Maybe to simulate clouds. Um, I'm not really sure what else. Now what we may can do is find some other fabric though. And like maybe cut out a door and some windows maybe we can do that I guess I need to look through my fabrics and I did not do that this just to show you was another piece of vintage quilt that I actually got out and thought about using um, although this is big enough guys for a journal cover so I think its purpose may be better served um, for that so I'm really glad you know I found this piece I did have to cut some things off of it and that's our extra page so we got to kind of figure out where we want it to go and I pulled this out because I was thinking about trees but um, that's not going to look right on there so just have to kind of figure out the placement and what I want to do because I would like to do some trees or some kind of flowers down in here maybe let me grab um, something and let's see um, we do have some yo-yos here I'm not sure if I have a solid blue one so let's see let's grab this and this Sorry about that, guys. Grabbing my little... Oh, look at there. That could be a cloud. Oh, uh, we found it already. Yeah, I think that would be a cute cloud. Oh, yeah. That would be good. Okay, so we're going to do that. We're going to call that a cloud. Just make sure that one's a bit big. Oh, but yeah, that's cute the way it's got the different colors in it. That would not be a cloud. Yep. Don't know if I have any on here that would work. It's kind of... These may work here, though. I don't know. I think I like the other one better. Let's see. Yep, I think I want that one. So, we can put these back up. And we will use that one as a cloud. Alright, so I'm going to put these back up real quick. And now, if maybe we can look through some stuff. 
stuff is over here. Let's see what we have. We could use as a door. Let's see what we have wrapped up in these. I really need to take this out and find something to put these in. Look, there's a piece of white quilt there. Okay, I won't fold that up. You guys that know me know I'm notorious at, you know, folding up tissue. Okay, so let's see what we got in this one. Okay, don't think any of those are going to work for a door. I mean, these are beautiful pieces, but... I mean, look at that. How gorgeous is that? Um, I do want to use a piece of lace. Um on it somewhere, I believe. Okay, let's see. Let's see what we have in here. We have that. Okay, that's not going to work, but... Uh, we could use this as a tree trunk, couldn't we? Okay, we'll leave that out. Let's try and see. I think this is all embroidery from Rachel over at Roxy Creations. Okay. I'm going to find... I actually have something to um, put those in. We have some small pieces here. Let's see what we have here in this pile. Let's see, we've already used that. I need to iron that one. Looks like we have a big old cupcake. I don't think that'll make a very good door. That's really pretty. Look how cute. Okay, nothing in there, I don't think. For a door. Let's see what we have in here. Nope. It's kind of cute. That might be a contender. Let's see. What else? Okay, this is a Christmas pack. So definitely not that. This was from uh, Rachel. But that is a Christmas pack. Let's see what we have in here. Little pieces. Nope, I don't think we have anything in here that's going to work. Alright, what do we have in these boxes? That's pretty. I don't think we have anything in there. Alright, let's see in here. Have 
Oh, that's pretty. It's a piece of quilting, and so is that one. All right, we shall keep looking. All right, so maybe this for the door. That might be cute. So I think we need something for windows. How about if we just did this for the windows? They had. Hmm. Not sure. See what else we have in here. Maybe this will be good for the door and that'll be good for the windows. I think I'm going to do that. Yep, yep. So let's go ahead and just cut a little piece of that off. That way we can put that back up. We'll put these in here. Here we go. All right. So we have our figure out where that went. All right. So we have. Okay. So this can be our door. So let's go about here. All right, so that's our door. Cute door. Okay, there's our door. Maybe we can give it a door handle as well. So now we need... One, two, three, four. We need some windows. All right. How about a window there? And a window there. I think this one needs to be cut down just a tad bit more. There we go. There's our windows. Hopefully that doesn't blend in too much. Okay. I think that's going to be it. Can you guys see that? Um... I may change my windows to something else because it looks like they're blending in. Well, how would it look if we had those as the windows? Had it the same. Let's see. I actually think I would be good with that. Let's get that little box back out. Where'd it go? Yep, there he is. Okay, come here, you. We are going to get us another window. Let's see, what is this? Four blocks. I can't count to four, apparently. Oh, yeah, I like that. Okay, yep, we're going to do that. We'll just have our windows and our doors the same. Okay, windows and doors. So, house, windows, and doors. Oh, come on, get on there. Thank you. Okay. There's that. Nail. Um, let's see. So we have that, and we have a cloud. 
now I need to figure out something for yeah okay all right guys I think we're gonna call it a video we pretty much have our base so we have our quilted piece and then we have our house I may end up taking the batting off of the house let's do that I have done that before and then we still have a house with the roof going the other way when we do that so let's get out our scissors where are scissors scissors are probably nowhere to be found okay let's see if these scissors will work and so I just think if we pull or take the batting off we can seems to be coming off pretty easy we can it'll just make it easier I think to do a garden Here we go. It's going pretty good. Okay, let's see. Yeah, these scissors are not very good for this. But hopefully it's getting the job done. There we go. Alright. Let's get that there. Alright. Alright, so far so good, guys. See, that seems to be pretty tight right there. Okay, cool. Aha. Now, if we get this off without pulling our roof off. Ha! There we go. And then we have this piece for another day which is almost fun our chimney will just be going the other way okay come back here you okay so now just pull these little pieces off aha yes 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 that's gonna be a lot funner I think or a lot better whatever it is you want to call it to be able to get us a garden maybe we'll even do a sidewalk going out the front I'm getting overly ambitious here there we go oh that's gonna be cute all right thank you so much Joni Joni loves vintage if I don't forget I will link her Etsy shop below because she has some amazing things over there and you could just you know send her a message and if you need something in a smaller size or a bigger scale or whatever it is just you know she'll let you know what she has alright guys so I think we're gonna call this a video so we have our base out so we have our um, quilted backing uh, for our old quilt and then we have our house for our country cottage awesome all right, we will be back next Saturday uh, to work on this again. Really, really excited. So just got to figure my flowers and all out and if we wanted to do anything else on it. Thank you all so much for joining me today. I really do appreciate it. You guys are awesome. Thank you so much for your support. You guys have a great day. Bye-bye.